Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we have another tool review. We're going to be reviewing this Master Cool Hydraulic Flaring Set. And this is a master set. You can make brake lines, transmission lines, pretty much any line with this tool. And before we go ahead and begin, guys, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button down below and definitely smash the like button because it helps the channel out. With that said, let's go ahead and get started on today's video. So before we go ahead and begin today's tool review guys, I would just want to mention that these tools are not uh, sponsored or paid for by anyone except for me. I purchased them with my own money and if you guys are interested in buying these tools, I will include a link down below in the description for an Amazon link and if you guys click on the link and buy it from that specific link, I do get a small referral fee through Amazon. So if you guys want to help out the channel and you guys are planning on purchasing this item that we are reviewing, go ahead and do so with that uh, link in the description. And with that said, let's go ahead and get into the tool review. So on our bench, we have our Master Cool Universal Hydraulic Flaring Set. And I absolutely love this set. This was paid for with my money, guys. This was not sponsored or given to me. And I absolutely love this tool. That's why I'm reviewing it. And I primarily use this for brake lines and transmission lines. This particular one is the master set. You'll see when we open it up, we have all the adapters and everything on there because they can make three or four different variants of this tool. And the first one that I bought, I did buy the lower variants of it and I had to return and get the master set, which is what we have in front of us. Now, starting off right out of the bat, we have a case, blow molded, really nice, really sturdy. Uh, definitely a good thing to have with this tool. And when we open it up, I'll give you guys a little bit of a close up here. This is the master set. You guys can see we have all of the adapters. Now when I initially bought this, I didn't know that these had different variants. You can buy ones that are just for brake lines that have the brake line fitting adapters. You could buy the ones that have the transmission fitting adapters, or you could buy the universal one that has everything on here. This will cover pretty much anything in automotive as far as flaring goes for brake lines, transmission lines, almost any sort of line that you'll want to make. Uh, anything that is metal at least. Uh, nothing plastic like fuel lines or anything like that that are made out of plastic or PVC composite. But if you are making metal fuel lines, guess what? This thing is a definite beast when it comes to that. And to show you guys around a little bit, everything is contained within this tool. We have our crimping tool, what actually makes the brake line. Uh, this is similar to the traditional tools that you've used, just with a twist on it. I'm not gonna go into in depth on how to use it. They do have videos online of people using them and showing them. And next time I do make a brake line, I will be busting on my camera and making a video of me using this because it's a great tool. Um, I've only used it a handful of times, uh, making a couple new lines. I haven't really used it too in depth. I really am not a big fan of making a lot of brake lines here on my shop, guys. They can be very tedious, and it's just a really long, strong job that I particularly don't like. So that's why this tool has not seen too much use from me. I primarily make new lines with it just for small items. I've used it a few times for power steering lines as well. Um, definitely helpful in that regard. Uh, they, this tool does come with a cutter. Uh, if I could pull it out here, as you guys can see, I've never used this cutter. Uh, usually any tool like this that comes with a supporting tool like a tube cutter or anything like that I always tell people buy a better cutter uh, just a heads up because the one that comes with the kit is not the greatest thing out there and uh, you need something better but overall you get all the adapters that you would need to make all various types of flares you get all the different adapters for holding in your different size lines as you guys can see all from up here and also back here. Now these tool adapters are all very different. I know they all look similar, but the reason why they all look similar is because they have to fit inside of the tool and be contained in there. But if you look at the different ends, you guys can see that they have like bubble flare ends on there. You have more deeper traditional uh, sets on there and even, you know, regular brake lines. Like I believe these are for the brake uh, line adapter just to make a double flare. So this tool is a definite must. One thing that I will say for this tool that even though I haven't used it a lot as of yet, I do fear that eventually this hydraulic portion for the flare uh, will maybe possibly have issues, but it is a hydraulic unit and I'm pretty sure that you can open it up and get it fixed up. Although mine has been pretty good. Um, that's just one thing that I see happening in the future. But overall, it's a very well-built sturdy tool. I absolutely love it. Uh, it makes making lines very easy quick and simple 
and the best thing about this that i will mention guys if you look at the overall profile of it it's a really good tool to use on the car so imagine you're making a brake line and you're on the car and you got confined space this tool is perfect because everything works in line it's a, a very good tool for that that's the main reason why i bought it because i hate making brake lines and if you ever tried using a traditional brake line flaring tool on a car it can be a nightmare and that's where this thing came in and even though i haven't used it as much it is still great every time i've used it i absolutely love this tool so if you guys have been thinking about picking up this uh set definitely something worth having now i will say it is on the pricier side the main reason why i bought this guys is because i own and operate my shop so i need tools like this uh most mechanics aren't gonna spend five or six hundred dollars on something like this just to leave in their toolbox especially if you're a dealer mechanic because more than likely you're not gonna be making your own custom lines uh, you will be supplied with lines in those scenarios so if you're working in an aftermarket shop like mine that has to be universal and do a lot of different things this is a must-have set for that specific uh, item but like i said guys it's take your pick i'm not going to say that every toolbox should have this but if you are making brake lines this is a definite tool to have because it can do brake lines transmission lines and pretty much any metal line you need on there from fuel to power steering so it's a great addition to have in your toolbox if you're able to afford and if you can justify spending this amount of money on this particular tool so with that said guys hopefully you guys found this video interesting Please comment, like, and subscribe because it definitely helps the channel grow. Hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll catch you guys on the next video.